say pietism, I believe, and I think we would all agree, pietism within the realm of the Christian life constantly moves the goalposts. Mm. It constantly moves the goal that as soon as you are in this sermon series and the application is greater this or better that mm-hmm. or more affections around this, yeah. you move on to the next series and it's a new thing. Yeah, it's it's Linus and Lucy in the football, you know, in, in Charlie Brown. <laughs> exactly. It right. really is. Yeah, you run up with all your great picture. Run it up is. with all your gumption. You go to kick yeah. it and, and the and ball then, is moved. And then boom, and I'm and I'm on my backside. You're exactly right. And you know? and you're you're almost depressed. Yeah, you're I'd say you often are. Yeah. Exactly discouraged. Right. Yeah. It's it's good. Um another thing I would say, I think the reason why Pietism dies a slow and painful death is essentially like this. So uh, I, I think we have some listeners in, in the UK, mm-hmm. and our, our dear brethren over there, they drive on the wrong side, I mean, the other side of the road. <laughs> okay. So imagine moving to the UK if you're in the States or vice versa. You have to completely switch everything that you are used to. Like right turns are now treated like left turns, and left turns are now treated like right turns. And what side is the passenger car? I mean, I would imagine for those of you who are listening, who have had this experience, as you approach your new vehicle in your new country, you got to the wrong side every time. Pietism is like that. When you are coming out of it, you have a very clear set pattern, roles, behaviors. It's almost like a reward system. Yeah. Like you have trained your brain that if I do this spiritual activity to this level, I will receive this kind of award reward. If I have my quiet time devotionals to this degree and have these sorts of feelings, today will go well for me. And if I do not, God will be punitive towards me, or God is backing away from me, backing out of his commitment. Like we we often think that it's like a mirror image with God, that as I back away from God, he backs away from me. That's right. And that is that is what a pietistic brain teaches. And so, again, to, to reemphasize, the reason why it's a slow and painful death is because you are relearning how to drive a vehicle that you've been in before, mm-hmm. which is the Christian life. But it's completely on a different side.